All right, we're going to count down from 20. Okay. Go ahead. 20. 19. 18. 17. 16. 17. 18. 15. 14. 13. <laughs> 12. 11. 10. 9. 8. 7. 6. 5. 4. 3. 2. Come on down and listen to the pod. We got Tone, Time, Nick, Pat, Connor, Cuba, Z, Big Motor, Dan, Evan, Bob, and Gump. So when we hear to hear you got nothing in the room. If you don't, then you're a sellout, but you're still. Round of applause, here come the boys of the park. Here come those boys. <laughs> Here uh, come those pop boys. Mr. Mansuri is here. What's up? Tone Diggs. What's up, dude? Boston Connor. Hell yeah. <laughs> Ty Schmidt. How we doing? <laughs> and behind the glass, the immortal Bubble Gumpino. What's up, dude? Zeke. What's up? Yeah, I think Mitt's back there, too. Hey, what's up, Nick? Oh, what's up? I am Nick. I am the uh, pseudo host for the day. <laughs> Uh, how, was, how was everybody's weekend? Everybody have a pleasant weekend? I uh, I got a little tape on my thumb here. I actually went to the Josh fight. Oh, and, nice. Uh, it's all right. Yeah, nice. I was not him. named Josh, and they found out, so they tried to take my thumb as penance. He doesn't Josh. even go here. Cut his thumbs off. The fuck's the Josh fight? Oh, you didn't see the Josh fight. Oh, you saw the Josh man. fight. You saw, saw the Josh. Uh, yeah. fight? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's a Josh fight. Just joshing around. Those were all Josh's? 6,500 Joshes gathered in a park in somewhere. I don't know where. I thought that was a joke. And beat the shit out of each other with pool noodles. No, it's real. How many times they go, I'm just joshing around. (laughs) Quite a few. Every single time. How many of them were pissed that the little, like, six-year-old was declared the winner? Like, I'm surprised some... You know, some they, Josh didn't come up and smack that kid right in the mouth with a pool noodle. I'm sure there were a handful of Joshes who wanted to start like a splinter cell. Yeah. Just, we're not with this. Let's That's not my down. campaign. I'm surprised they didn't watch the movie, The uh, was it The One? With Jet Li, and he oh, kills yeah. everyone that's like him, and then he becomes the most powerful Jet Li of all time. Yeah, mm-hmm. super Jet Li. Better watch out that Josh kid. Josh Peck would be there, and he'd just be dubbed the king. Josh Gad, maybe. Yeah. Josh Gad. Mm, Josh true. Duhamel. Yes. Of course. Mm. Oh. Josh Hartnett, probably. Yes. All that was rock. rock. All right. I mean, come on. Have you ever you given a valid Josh criticism Hartnett. of Hartnett? Yeah. All he does is that one puppy dog face and. Oh man, my heart is broken. <laughs> <laughs> Have you seen Lucky Number Eleven, dude? Yeah. You mean the one where Giamatti dominated him? Giamatti, Giamatti is not in Lucky Number Eleven. Nope. We talk about he fires fucking. Oh, Josh Brolin. Bullets oh. out of his face. Dude, you're thinking of Josh Clive Allen? Owen, Tony, Josh Allen. <laughs> yeah, Josh where Brolin? was Josh Allen? <laughs> oh, Josh Charles. Josh Listen, Charles. Hartnett. Just think about how. Listen, I'm not a. He was the worst character no in all of Black Hawk Down. Wow. Whoa. Uh, Whoa. Holy shit. Fucking, what about the terrorists? Fucking Banna was better. <laughs> <laughs> you mean the Somalians? Answer the question, Cody. Listen, the Somalians were just trying to had to do what they had to do. Oh okay? shit. They were Uh-oh. just trying to Uh-oh. trying to live. No. Okay, oh, no, we got no. a Somalian sympathizer. <laughs> <laughs> I thought Pearl Harbor was like one of your favorite movies. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, he was fairly nah. Japanese. Dude, there, no, there was no reason for a goddamn love story in that movie. We thought you were dead, Rafe. I agree, actually. <laughs> Thank you, Connor. Yeah. No, uh, I mean, that movie stopped. There's no question about it, but I could have sworn you loved it. Tony. That's why Midway was better, ben even though. Wow. Midway fucking Midway. But it was better um, because there was no love story. Sure, the airport was all war. Was Woody in Midway? Harrelson? Yeah. I think so. That movie was so no, bad. I said Ed, seen it. Ed Skeen. <laughs> Ed Skeen was in it? <laughs> Midway. <laughs> checking now how'd they fucking land ed skeen dude the, the new transporter dario oh, no. nahara yeah he left oh, that man. and got wally piff by the other guy he did one of the jonases was in midway <laughs> dario yeah. did get wally piff dude big time took me a second to realize mm-hmm. it too. Oh, that's yeah. not dario no not the same guy second dario wasn't as good looking what do you got z no first dario dario was jack was, was uh, yeah. he was uh what the, whatever the fucking deadpool yeah ed skeen ed, ed skeen yeah <laughs> What was My brain just turned on. 
That's good. Oh, I thought Zeke was looking that up. He just played us for a fool. No, I am. What, who am I looking for? No, but I'm saying if Hartnett Josh was, Reynolds. <laughs> if Hartnett was, Josh Reynolds, was so good, yeah. I do not see him on here. Flamed out like a magic. What was that? Woody what was Harrelson. the movie he was in yeah. that was like his? Uh, was Woody Harrelson in Midway is what we were. Josh Harnett, where he's just walking <laughs> around all the time. What? Excuse me. What? Huh? Is Luke Evans really Chris one, Evans? What was one of Josh Harnett's yeah. main movies? <laughs> Seriously. Uh, Fucking. What was the one with the alien that won their ears? Six conversations. The faculty. The faculty. <laughs> 40 days, 40 nights. No. <laughs> oh, the, Alaskan, the Alaskan vampire. Yeah, he was that. Dad Hart, yeah, you can't hate on that movie. <laughs> no so way. Where you jerk off for 40 days? No, that is like uh, 40 yeah. days of something. I can't remember what no, it's called. No, when it's 30 days of night in Alaska and there's all the vampires. Hartnett's in it? Yeah. yeah. He's yeah. the lead. Josh Hart. Go on. Josh Hart. <laughs> I didn't see it for good reason. <laughs> Unbelievable. Was he was he in Black Dahlia? Let me see if I can find a movie that I like. I never saw in. Black Dahlia. Well, I like Black Hawk Down. I'm saying he was the worst character in that. I movie. think he was with old ScarJo. Josh Jacobs. <laughs> Josh Jacobs. <laughs> It go. appears You're we're rolling. never going to get confirmation on Woody Harrelson. So <laughs> yeah, Woody Harrelson was in there. He Turns was? out Hart yes. is still making movies. He is in Midway. By the way. Oh, he's back. Yeah, he's in Penny Dreadful. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, so is Luke Evans related to Chris Evans? I do not believe so. All right, that was worth a try. Man, hey, what'd you do this weekend, you yeah. fucking oh, slap mitt? Please. Please. Had a weekend. <laughs> slap mitt. Inform oh, us. <laughs> I don't know. I, mean, I just hung out. Went to, went to a bar on Friday. Hung you out. Hang oh, out we apologize. Shit. Hold on. We apologize for Mitt. That those that listen to the pod on Friday mornings early didn't get a chance because he was too stoned to remember to upload it. <laughs> Uh -oh. uh, there was a mix-up, and this was 100% my fault. Here we go, Bill. Yeah, Bill. I, uh, I go went out of order though. of how yeah. I did the uh, routine, and I uh, sent it to Bill before oh. I posted it. No, 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 before I posted it, it was uh, my fault. As you can tell, the YouTube you was up out. at the right time. Hey, you'll never be fucking late if you just watch it on YouTube. That goes up at fucking midnight every oh. single time. Oh. Uh, He'll uh, cut you, Don. <laughs> <laughs> that did. was my bad. I am sorry. Listeners will not happen again. Oh, but was, was already Mitt. in the weekend, Mitt. Solid What's apology, Mitt. Uh, anything else anyone would like oh, to Oh, Josh Harnett was in 40 Days and 40 Nights and 30 Nights. Beautiful oh. day on Sunday. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. When was. walked around downtown. Saw you taking selfies by the fountain. It's a good pitch. Self-timer oh. gum. <laughs> Bought a Z turn. Oh yeah. oh, yeah. I thought oh, Diggs yeah. was kidding when he told Tony, me this. This is a bobcat? Awesome. No, it's not a bobcat. Mickey Mouse? Oh, it's not a deer. No, nah, yeah. Caterpillar? It's a Toro. The Craftsman? I got a Toro. Uh, Toro. Got a Toro. Toro. Z turn, but I got a Toro. Now you got I a Craftsman? To. I mean, it's taking me fucking five hours to cut my grass every goddamn week, and I've had to buy a Z turn. Big yard. What is it, electric? No, it's nice. Gas it's good. Gas. Gas. Fucking, there it is. Oh, I got 20 horsepower. Electric. Can you handle that? Oh, yeah. Can I handle that, dude? Kidding me? I was see, Z turning while you're still in your mama's baby. <laughs> see, that's the thing, though, Tony. Is once, <laughs> once you commit to a Z turn, <laughs> ain't no going back. Well, not like, guess what, pal? Your lawn better fucking look good, because uh, otherwise, hey, you're man. the jackass who's got a you know twenty five hundred dollar lawnmower and you got a <laughs> shitty lawn. You know, you better start <laughs> edging that thing. Yeah, yeah, listen, yeah. you know me. I know. You I know. know. I'm just saying. I hey, you're in it them. now, pal. Whether you want to be or not, you are I, in I it now. Be. I'm okay. fully in. I okay. want to be. You in, baby? You got a sprinkler system. Set up. I think those are pretty expensive. <laughs> yeah, you gotta fucking. Uh, are we going all in on the lawn or not? Well, I know all I can tell you, Gumpy, is that there's a uh, there's a cup holder in it. So that's good. I'll be awesome. sipping pounders of claws while cutting them. I'm starting oh, to get concerned that it's always windy up on my patio. It's very windy well, everywhere around yeah, here. Yeah, it's a very windy uh, city. Not the more in Chicago, but it's the windy city, Indianapolis. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's right. Chicago's windy, worse. indy. It's funny that you uh, mentioned mowing, Tony, because I did have to mow my yard and uh, the fucking assholes behind me. The kids always throw balls over the fence and stuff like that. Uh -huh. Ran over a croquet ball, basically fucking my lawnmower is done done for. Uh, luckily, oh. luckily, I was able to finish the job and get it done with this thing. I'll tell you what, a after croquet. I... Croquet. Where do you I live? Could, yeah, what kids are croquet? That's what I'm saying. I mean, and... 
why the hell is the croquet ball going over the fence? <laughs> I you know? can't think of a worse ball to run over for a lawnmower. Oh, and believe me, it shot out of it and fucking hit the fence like a cannonball coming out of it. I mean, it startled the shit out of me. Yeah. But yeah, I was, I was, I had, oh, to, I still had like half my lawn to mow after that and it was, I mean, the guy thought it was going to blow up. So yeah, I got to get a new lawnmower. That's not great. Careful with those croquet balls. Well, I, 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 I damn near hucked that thing through their window. I'd lawn it back into their yard. Listen, but. you think you got problems? Let me tell you about some real lawn problems. I got a dandelion yard. Oh, 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 me too, my every, every house on oh, my block no. just flourishing green lawns. Mine's covered in yellow flowers. Weeds. Well, you got to call a lawn company. You got to pee on it. Sunday lawn care. I don't like other people taking care of my yard. Well, I respect that. I agree with that, but I mean, they got industrial <laughs> weed sprayers. They yeah, do. no, I, I took, went out there with the spray myself, and those it, it are do no. <laughs> those are way too small. I have the neighborhood guys cutting my lawn. You Their do. football team, yeah, starting quarterback and starting that corner. Well, it might nice. be a running back. You got a couple kids cutting your lawn, dude. Oh yeah, I was not happy when I found out about it. <laughs> See, <laughs> are you serious? They, they get under. See, I all thought of... you bought a wheelbarrow. I have a wheelbarrow. I don't have a lawnmower though. <laughs> That's <laughs> a so, big difference, Tony. Hey, I'll sell you one. Ooh, what do you got? That's right. Why? Well, I, I think my yards might be a little bigger. I, I need to be a big boy. Yeah, you probably Tony's got his eater for you. <laughs> <laughs> Not selling that one, but so, what do you have probably at the pub, uh, the person that used to live downstairs doesn't live there anymore, and he left his lawnmower. Is that fair game? Yeah, take it. Absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. yeah you can take it. Anything that's left at that place, take it. See, yeah, there's a massive chance I just leave all my shit and just say I would throw is. everything you have <laughs> in the gift. downstairs yeah. for what that fucking sound machine did we to you. We could guys. do that. Right. You still know the code. I do, do know the code. Okay, perfect. I'm gonna do that today, right after this. <laughs> <laughs> Not kidding. So no, go ahead, fair. take it. Yeah, dude. Yeah. Yeah. Lawnmower is yours. That's yours now. Right, I'm going after. Yeah. Take care of it. That guy's gone. <laughs> He's never coming up. back. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Pull that fucking ripcord. Now. It's brand new, dude. That thing is nice. It I don't is. know if you guys have walked by it. Well, I the know grill, you, too. I know you. I can tell you don't want to divulge the information that I heard. I believe I heard about 20 yards away from me the other day, but this guy ain't coming back, right? Uh, uh Yes, he is. Uh, he has a, what do you call it? Long gone. He went. has a warrant under. I, I searched his name and he is wanted. But that's the thing. Do I want to steal a warrant? So he skipped yeah. town. Yeah, he, he's did, a wanted man. Does just, he know your you, name? Yeah, you just got to hope oh, he, he goes in for a nickel and serves the dimes. He. Mm-hmm. But he comes out like That's Tom Toretto, and he's like, where the hell is my lawnmower? No, oh, yeah. Either, either, my lawnmower. either that, dude, or you're an accessory, and the fucking cops are like, mm-hmm. hey, hey, what do you know about this guy? We know you have his lawnmower. You're obviously pretty pretty close with him. Why do you use Oh, shit. And you know then, what they boom. say, Zeke? Dead man tell no tales. That's right. That's right. They also mow no lawns. Mm-hmm. As well, far as we're concerned, that mower's yours. Hell yeah. This man is already dead. Go for Better you. Again, it's a lawnmower, not a fucking Z turn, though. It's going to take me like six hours to cut my lawn. It's all right. You'll be all right. Pelled, you'll be all right. Yeah. Just do it with the, the football kids. Do it with the football kids. <laughs> do it like, hey, I need help here. So I'll you pay guys think price. 50 bucks is a lot of money? Yeah. Each? No, just 50 bucks. For 25 how each. How big is your yard? Uh, over half an acre. Yeah, that is not how, a lot. No, you got to steal. Yeah. How yeah. long are they taking? How long? Two lawnmowers. And like an hour and a half, but they're like fucking sprinting. Like no they're way does it take an hour and a half? No way. Okay, yard. so these guys well, two have never mowed a lawn before. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Like, doesn't have a big lawn, huh? Doesn't have a big one. Not for two lawn mowers. It ain't that big, Tony. It's oh. big. You gave him fifty bucks. Fifty bucks. There's a slight grade to it, though. Yeah, and then you gotta go outside the fence because I own more property outside the fence. Zeke might live on the steepest hill in Indiana. <laughs> what do they have to go all the way to Scotland? Fucking to grow your patch over yeah. there. <laughs> <laughs> and Lord Zeke says cut. You're gonna move that <laughs> fence back so it's all your whole. I heard that's right? very expensive. Of course. I heard it's very, very expensive. And I might put a basketball court. Just get the Behind fucking. The Whoa. Get that's the not expensive. <laughs> 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 Yeah. Well, that's cheaper, I think. <laughs> got these neighborhood kids fucking porn. Yeah. yeah. Hey, football guys, get over here. Did they walk up to your house or did you? Like, they, they were doing the neighbor's yard and they said they were, they were trying to save money for pads. They that's that guy. Oh, so those teams going to pull away. <laughs> <laughs> they gonna buy their own pads? I don't know. Apparently, I asked Mid about this. And I guess they just give cheap pads, and people just try to get better pads. I don't know though. Fucking Zeet's got the little giants <laughs> over there cutting his lawn. Yeah, you should just give him pads, and then be like, "All right, now you got to mow this shit for free for the next two years." You're welcome. How expensive are pads though? 
Dude, helmets are really fucking expensive now. I mean, there's no way they don't have to buy their own helmets. No dude. chance. Yeah. No, they probably seriously their school probably just has really shitty old helmets. Uh, like no, you get sued for buy that. new ones. No, they can be like ten years old. Wow, fucking huh? pair of shoulder pads. I just don't know if it's like two hundred fifty bucks. Yeah. Yeah, the lowest. There's a five hundred dollar pair on here. Jesus. What are you? So well, yeah. What's Dick selling them for? The last month, I could probably pay half of that. Five seventy nine ninety nine. Curbside pickup available at Dick's. Okay. Should I just buy him a set? It's like a nice like neck roll with it. Oh, you get a hundred. Yeah, tight in front of the wall. Nice. <laughs> a quarterback with a fucking neck over. roll. You get a nice awesome. pair of Rydell ones for fucking two eighty. How old are these kids, Z? I don't know, but I I was throwing the ball with them the other day. I was like, yeah, you're gonna be good. Are you like the head coach? <laughs> 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 the gridiron guy. Yeah. Bring the whole team out, out to here. cut the grass. Uh, uh, are you the coach, dude? That's an honest question. I am not the coach, but I... I not I, yet. I think I might be now. Let's get into the fog. Coach Z. The other Josh Allen. I like that. Some good long Josh, Josh Allen. <laughs> coach Z. Pass rushing. Josh Allen. All right, here we go. Uh, scientists nice. are alarmed by lab-grown human-animal hybrids. Uh, earlier this month, scientists announced they'd successfully cloned part human, part monkey hybrids with human stem cells into old macaque embryos. Oh, shit. Be careful now. This is <laughs> not good. No. I've had a taste for bugs recently. <laughs> so what they inject you with? I don't know. You've just been eating bugs? <laughs> <laughs> you just ripping apart fucking tree trunks? And <laughs> Like to mow to poop. Frogs eat. It's a grub. What's it look like? <laughs> Zeke's just picking off lights off everyone. Uh, hey, get over here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna pick you for a little bit. Dumping Mountain Dew all over his counters and <laughs> tables and just going to bed and then coming back. Leaving the door open. Zeke, you've been throwing your own shit at home? <laughs> yeah, dumping dump it to your hand and just launching it at the wall? Oh, uh, yeah. Just wait. Just wait. There's gonna be a good picking uh, yeah. of that poop over there. Yeah. Don't you worry. <laughs> Gonna be Wait till the flies come around that thing. Oh, baby. We'll be eating for weeks. <laughs> oh, <That's> next. Awesome. <laughs> Shark humans will oh, be cool. Oh, shit. <laughs> Whoa. Bill. 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 Oh, Bill. Bill. Bill, what did Bill, you do? You scumbag, dude. <laughs> I just read the story. <laughs> <laughs> Bill, that is you. Holy shit. It's totally me, dude. It's Walter McComas. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, my car got... <laughs> I, did. Oh, I didn't even know it was a spy pen. I didn't even know. Yeah. Who, who knew? What was he filming him doing? Like yeah. taking tests? I don't know. I heard Bill on the phone today buying like a seven million dollar car. So I can't Bill. wait. To see I'm just trying to buy a fucking uh, truck to be like you, Tony. You know. Wow. Uh, Bill is becoming fucking... a truck guy, from what I've heard. Yeah. Yeah. We're gonna have truck wars in the office. Me and Tony <laughs> fucking Tonka trucks over here. You know. Uh, what are you telling him? My, my truck will do to his truck. Hey, Bill. Tony's truck pull your fucking truck backwards. <laughs> I'm trying to go with a fucking Toyota tune machinery, not this fucking hunk of junk Chevy Toyota. that Tony's got over. Whoa! Oh, shit! You're going Toyota. foreign for your truck, you uh, fucking loser. Toyota, uh, Toyota is actually assembled in Indiana. Yeah, yeah it doesn't matter where it's Indiana assembled. Made. Where was it fucking invented? Yeah. Bill, with your driving history, you might want to consider like a Panzer tank or something. <laughs> I, I did just watch that like truck. Six cars. I did just watch that tread documentary. I think I am going to find like half inch plate steel to put Do around it. all of my vehicles. How are you not getting a Tesla? Yeah, I yeah. Can't that would be a bill move. My, what do you mean? It's like twenty four thousand. I also don't have anywhere dude. to charge a test. You're the cheapest guy the we know. Bill. There's no way you spend any mainframe. money except for Pokemon. I'm gonna, I'd have to run a ether or a uh, extension cord out of my apartment, like over a yeah. road so, into my yard. And yeah, yeah. 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 supercharger out there the so I can steal it. Spent all his money on these spy pens. What's next? Uh, Tony, Tony, Tony. Tony! Tony Mackey, that is, uh, has officially become Captain America. And to those who say he's not a leading man, he says he doesn't give a shit. His son says he's cool. It's cool. Yeah. What are you talking about? How do you like that, you, Tony? Hey, you addressed this. I yeah. tweeted it. Mm -hmm. I tweeted that Anthony Mackey had his leading man moment and is now a leading man. So I'm glad you've come around. He had a. He finally had his moment. I wasn't just gonna fucking hand him the keys. You wanted he to earned hurt. it. Yeah. He had his moment in triple nine, dude. Great film. That's right. And outside the wire. Yeah. Did everybody <laughs> finish? Jacek Koloff. <laughs> Falcon and Winter Soldier. Oh yeah, no, I have not started yet. Oh man. Oh, so, that, so that's 
that's what happens at the end. He is now Captain America. Uh-huh. That's, a, that's okay. a spoiler. So I don't have to watch spoiler. it. But the suit looks sweet. Yeah, I saw the suit. suit does awesome. look sweet. Why has he got to have the head thing? Yeah. He I looks don't mind like the guy I, from the boys. I don't even mind the head thing. I just don't like Fucking that his ears are sticking speed. out of the that. head thing. It's weird to me. I'm like, if you're yeah. flying around in the air, you want your ears covered up, I would think. Oh, so don't you want like a it's metal true. suit? Like, why isn't it metal? It's vibranium. It's not though. It's it just is fucking not. cloth. Yeah. No. This yeah, is high, high quality leather. Leather. Excuse leather. Me, yeah. leather. Leather. No. Same it's as cap. Capsules leather. Yeah, I know, but yeah. it was made of Wakanda. Was flying through the I air. I think just the wings. Eat. I think the whole thing was made of Wakanda. The whole thing might have been. Oh yeah, because the box was delivered from the Wakandans, right? Yeah, so it's probably like Black Panther's suit. Rest in peace. No, because oh, if All it was, right, they would have showed him taking a punch and then. Using that energy from the punch to shoot it back. Very Correct. True. Yeah. Very true. Just like in Mortal Kombat. Did everyone enjoy it, though? It does make sense. I did enjoy Listen it. Listen to recommendation for... Are we talking Mortal Kombat now, or are we talking about this? <laughs> we're talking no, about we're this not getting, No, we'll, we'll save that. It's okay, coming. Don't worry. sure. But yes, I thought this was very good. <laughs> I would. I don't know if I'm... Yeah, I'm, I'm shocked. <laughs> <laughs> tell, tell you, I like Nemo. Baron Zemo? Zemo? Yeah, he was it was cool to get his character. Frederick Zola. Frederick Zola. Frederick Zola? Mm-hmm. Oh yeah. Sniper from the from a, uh, Nation's Pride. The glorious glorious bastards. Bastards. Yeah, the I Nation's do like Pride. That guy does crush. Fucking Joe uh, Shoshana broke his heart. Oh, hey, why, Shoshana? Do you think this is better than uh <laughs> WandaVision? No. Yeah. No? WandaVision. I so did good. personally just because it was a little both. more action, but I wouldn't say WandaVision's bad. Like Wanda I said, was the very first two story. episodes stunk, and then it got better. When I, does this start heating up? Well, like, I if I just want to jump in and watch like a couple episodes, episode, episode one, one, two or three, one was two or three, and then, and then you have to watch it all the way through. Watch the intro. It's only one. Five, well, you got you to watch the end episode. Oh, it's only six episodes. Yeah. yeah. It's, it's Honestly, if anything, you could probably the watch the first. The you game could game probably watch like the first three episodes and then just skip to the end. I mean, you're gonna miss no, but the story like that's when it lulls down. Yeah, but if you're gonna invest in three episodes, and it's only three more episodes why would you just skip to the it end it was either the third or the fourth one that the john wick director or creator directed of this series oh, okay and it was the best one okay yeah. see yeah. Now that's, sort of, that's a, a nice little nugget that that i like uh-huh you guys think loki's gonna be good i think loki's gonna be the best one really yeah i do because i think they're gonna tie a bunch of, of the uh plot bullshit tom hiddleston together. don't miss i love mm-hmm. tom too yeah and Owen wilson's in it mm-hmm. true come on oh wilson is in it and you get to learn about the timekeepers come on Come on, Time keepers. As we know, and with, we know O'Connor, big time guy. Big time yeah. guy. Big yeah. time in space. Show me the money. I'll watch it. What's next? Oh, yeah, of course. Show me the money first. Oh, shit. Woman swallowed by python as she checked ah. on her cornfield. A woman in Indonesia was swallowed whole <laughs> by a goddamn python. Oh, this is just a Tuesday. <laughs> this python is a weapon. I mean, this is not the first... First woman that's been swallowed in Indonesia by a python. Yeah. Twenty-three Probably foot not. long python. A hundred villagers searched the area and found it. Killed the snake, and I'm assuming how fast was this fucking thing going? Out. Wait, she was dead? No, they stay alive in there. I, probably eight days. If I were her, you carry dead. around an air tank if you're checking your I think field. if you're inside the snake, I think you're dead <laughs> by then. Yeah. I think yeah. it crushes you first and then ingests Brings you. Oh, true, yeah. yeah. Probably coil it Not if you go limp. I, I don't know much about anacondas. Or pythons. Yeah. Mm-hmm. How strong is their bind? Pretty strong. Too Let strong. Let me look it up. Remember like, can one, I dude? fucking bow flex it? I don't think so. This, this is an honest question. This, this thing's, thing's 23, 23 feet, feet long. Long. Okay. Remember that one dude did that uh, That's almost sideline a special no, on like Discovery or National Geographic. I can't remember what it was, but he wore like a suit that measured it and he had like protective plate on him and he went into like a pit with one of these things and it let him crush it. Really? Like he got wrapped up by a snake. I forget what it was called. But Sports science. It, it, it felt like that. Yeah, it was like a yeah. dude in a compression suit just getting like crushed by one of these things. Is that why there's no more sports science? That's, That's fucking terrible. terrible. It fucked him up. Yeah. Well, you remember Knoxville and fucking Wee Man got into that ball pit with one of these oh, things. Yeah. And yeah. It was you know like wrapped around Wee Man's legs, and they were worried he was gonna like drown in the ball pit and you know just get sucked <laughs> under. So these things are fucking huge. They are 23 feet. I mean, that's massive. Can you imagine this lady seeing that thing? It just like pops up on its back and it's fucking two stories. Holy oh. shit. They can weigh as much as 550 pounds. Listen, Fine. if, oh, if Ice Cube yep. didn't break out, <laughs> yeah. there's snakes so dead as big. 
Yeah, so this guy, Paul <laughs> Rosalie, he did a special on TV, and the snake, he originally was going to let the snake eat him. Oh, okay, cool. But as it started to crush him, he said he felt his arm was starting to break, so he tapped out, and his team had to come in and get the snake off him. So he kind of wussed out. Just shot But he still, snake. like, it was yeah. fucking him up. So who wins in a battle? How many pounds of pressure? It was like a lot of pounds of pressure. Two tons? Oh, okay. yeah. It was a 20-foot anaconda he, he battled. Jesus. It was a lot of pounds of pressure. This thing's 23 feet. No, I just looked it up, and it said uh, 6 to 12 pounds per inch or something like that. Oh, I, could, I could take that down. Yeah. 6 to no. 12 pounds? Dude, per inch. 23 feet. So what is that? Per inch. inch. 12 just... times 23. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Don't have that one. You got it. <laughs> I just, I just don't have it. Still you got it, it, dude. I just don't have it. Like you got 288 it. 288? No. <laughs> <laughs> 288. Close. Uh, Closer. Does Closer. Mick got this one? You got uh, it, Mick. What is it? Like three. I'm going to guess like 312. Dude, it's 276. Sure. I was close. Uh, you were very close. Well, I did 12 times 12 was 144, and you double that. 288. Yeah. So we're saying 276 pounds. <laughs> Great idea. Like, yeah, I can do that. I don't know, Zeet. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I just don't know. What's well, next? What would you rather, quicksand or this? Quicksand. Uh, quicksand. Anaconda. Uh, quicksand. 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 Oh, you quicksand. guys are crazy. You just don't move. Yeah, you just don't move. Wait for help. Don't, don't, move, don't panic and you're good. Ah, you're crazy. All right, going right to need a little help with this one because I don't think I know who everyone on here is. You're getting jumped by 50 ninjas. You can only pick oh, three people to, to help Jesus. fight the 50 ninjas. Okay, we got Bruce Lee, Enter the Dragon. We got fucking Walker, Texas Ranger, oh, Chuck yeah. Norris. Is Walker? that C? Is C the Chronicles? I believe that's, that's, that's Riddick, yeah. Vin, yeah. Dude. I don't know who C's D is. in the dark. That guy's... Uh, that's Vin Diesel, baby. What, C? No, D. No, D. D is uh, oh, I Ong Jay Bak, I think. Yeah. The guy from Ty Ong Bak. Ong Bak. We got E is Furiosa from Mad Max, yeah. Fury Man. Road. F is Batman. F like Batman? <laughs> is that F like? Is that that I think it is F like Batman. G, we got the Kill Bill, fucking uh, Bill. Brad. Bill. Mm-hmm. H is Daniel, Daniel Russo. Russo, yeah, of course. I is uh, Angelina Jolie, shit. Tomb Raider, and J, of course. <laughs> Cena, I don't know who K is. That's Michael, Michael Jai Jai White, right? Mm-hmm. It is. Spawn, yeah. L, Jet Li. That's Jet Li. Yeah, that is Jet Li. Is that Medea? That's no, fucking that's Medea. Medea. And uh, that is Medea. <laughs> uh-huh. And it's uh, Skarsgård's kid. Right? Eric mm-hmm. Tarzan. Oh, yeah. is John Bernthal as the Punisher? Okay. P is Jackie Chan. Oh, oh, yeah. Bronx, let's go. Why are there so many? Q <laughs> is uh, the Black Widow. R is John Wick. S is Indiana Jones. And T is Tony Montana. How many of these pick we picking? Pick three. three. Jeez, right, this is so impossible. This is pretty easy. Impossible. You go, I, you you go fucking. One. You go Wick. Yep. Cena. Yep. And Medea. <laughs> Jackie Chan. Ah! <laughs> Wait, why is Scarface on here? Because he's got a fucking. Say hello to my little friend! <laughs> That's why. Yeah. Why is, yeah. He dies in that scene. Oh, no. Uh, <laughs> oh, no, I'm, going, you. I'm changing up. I'm going Wick, Cena, and Burnthal as Punisher. <laughs> I'm going Wick, Cena, Chucky Norris. Give me a break. Yeah. Just give me Medea. That's all I need. Maybe Bertha. <laughs> John Cena. Tony Montana. And fucking Riddick. Give me Wick, Nicena, and Laura Croft, Tomb Raider. Ooh. 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 Yeah. yeah. I mean, Wick and Cena are layups. Yeah. There's yeah. no question about it. I'll, I'll go with Bride. Okay. Fucking Kill Bill. No Shoot. one's taking Batman? I love not Batman. Affleck. Not Affleck. Not Affleck. Fair. I mean, he, you he take did Karate fuck Kid? people up, though. Yeah, hey, but. Well, you get me Michael Jai White as Spawn, and he's my third with uh, Wick and Cena. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's a good call. I mean, Wick could do it on his own. You could just pick Wick and just watch him. Actually, give me give me uh, Jackie Chan. Is that Tarzan? Is that what? Yeah, it is? yeah, that's Tarzan. Never saw it. It was all right. It was okay. It kind of stunk. Samuel <laughs> Jackson was pretty good in it. If he I was. remember correctly. I got something to tell you. You guys aren't gonna like. Oh no. I've never watched a John Wick. Gum. It's just got of all shit. people. Okay. Hey, instead of watching Bangkok Dangerous five <laughs> times this weekend, watch, <laughs> watch the John Wick series. Oh, Nicholas Cage not make this fucking list. John Wick Parabellum. Question. Gumpy, I mean, let me just say, if you watch that, that, John Wick, you might be changing your tune about how you feel about the Fast franchise because yeah. Wick will sway you over to the other side. No, uh, not only. Boban was in John Wick 3. Yeah. Yeah. Your favorite. Yeah. Boban. 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 
I'll we'll get on. to it one of these days. He even made Com- look Common look like a badass. Yeah, yeah, yeah he yeah. did. You'll like it. Com- What's Bubba next? Yeager. Common was the s- the uh, assassin in that uh, Liam Neeson movie. Taken. Nope. Wait, one more time. The Gray? Star Wars? Who did he say? Common was the assassin in that Liam Neeson movie with oh. the guy from... Oh, yeah, he was good. Run All Night. Yeah, he that, was good fucking, assassin. that movie's a banger, Common's also dude. in the show Hells on Wheels. There's yes, a new Liam Neeson movie. Did anybody realize that? I, yeah, the... Um, What's it called again? Like, I heard it was not great. The good guy. He's no. like a, that's sharpshooter. Sniper. It was called something. It's called the good guy. The good guys with uh, Better Call Saul, I believe. <laughs> no, it's uh, that's nobody. 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 Uh, uh, have, that, has anyone right? seen that yet? Is it no. out? It's it's out now. I haven't. I, I want to yeah. see it. I've heard it's awesome. When he's John Wick. Yeah, it's yeah. amazing. Saul Wick. Ah, the the marksman. Oh, or no, man. honest thief. That's what it was. Honest thief. Good I, guy. Good guy. <laughs> honest <Yeah>. thief. <laughs> One and the same. I knew it was around there. No, I haven't seen Honest Thief yet. Neither have I. There should yeah, be a new Ted won't. movie. A new what? Ted. Ted three. Yeah, Ted Four. Right? Honestly, you've got a six point oh on uh, IMDb, so okay. take that. One. Ted like Wahlberg. Ted. Yeah, yeah, Ted Three. All right, these <laughs> TLC extreme sisters share a boyfriend and sleep in the same bed. Has anyone watched the show? Is it a new show? I'm uh, confused I'm, by this picture. Is there two of the guy, that guy? Or I think he's standing sister? in front of a mirror. There are. The, <laughs> this show follows around different groups of sisters. I think three groups of sisters. One set is a set of twin sisters who married a set of twin. Okay, that's the picture we're looking at. Mm-hmm. That's hysterical. Oh, oh these guys. Insist, this isn't the same guy. No, it insists they don't fool around with each other. There is another they group of twin do. sisters yeah, that share the same boyfriend. And okay. he does everything with them. They said they do everything together. They've only spent more than an hour apart in their entire lives. Even behind the kneecap? Jesus. They eat the same food. They wear the same clothes. They get behind the same kneecap. Excuse me, what? Wait, if two such <laughs> twins have kids, will they look the same? Will the kids look the same? You're asking me like, I know. I don't know. Just oh, thinking about Anna, science here. Anna and Lucy. <laughs> you got to mix and match the chromosomes. And <laughs> just, you said Anna and Lucy are the names? Yeah, Z, you want me to text you? You sound yeah. like tacos. He kind of looks like... I mean, this is insane. Okay, this is so why those are the, yeah, those are the sisters that share the same boyfriend. He looks just like <laughs> someone. Like, I think he Actually, I think this is the guy from... Um, that fucking stupid prank show. He looks like Carbonaro. <laughs> really? No, not that one. <laughs> no, he looks like Zito. Joe Gatto and Carbonaro. Yeah. Where are the Come twins? On. Like in anybody Zito, can get it today. Zito, I just huh? you Where are the Where are you doing? He looks just like that fucking show that you guys like. Big Trick Energy? Yeah, zoom in on that. <laughs> oh, 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 he looks like a dump is, with hair. Oh, oh, he looks like oh, Murr. Jesus, <laughs> yeah. You're thinking of Murr. Yeah. If I actually shave my beard, I might. Yeah, you're not. <laughs> Dude, Fuck. That is you, Gump. Murr's banging uh, Jenny and Lucy. <laughs> so that guy's got a twin who's married to the other one? No, no, no. Hey, Murr, I'm going to. Oh, this is another. Him. This guy okay. just smacks cheeks all day. <laughs> Yeah, it's, it's, a fucking, it's a fucking circus. The original picture was the two sets of twins that are married to each other, which freaks me out. Oh, okay, okay. Which, yeah. That one right there, yeah. 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 Mm-hmm. What's the last sister? The last group of sisters Whoa. are sisters that are like two years apart, but like them? just do everything together, sleep in the same bed, even though one of them has a boyfriend. They claim they don't sleep with him, but they do. They do. <laughs> yeah. This shit's crazy. TLC's wild. <laughs> TLC wild. does not give a fuck about no. putting people's business out there in any way possible. The weirdest shit they can find. Jesus. I respect it. That's crazy. Yeah. And they, go, they do it. How TLC do you, was sister wives, right? Did I'm going to assume so. Probably. I'm assume Probably. all those, my 900 pound life yeah. and all that shit's on <laughs> mm-hmm. TLC. Mm. What's next? Little people, big planet. Yeah. <laughs> Roll off farms. Oh, yeah. here's one mm-hmm. of the twins. <laughs> <laughs> Did anyone see the Pinocchio movie that was nominated for two no. Oscars no. that came out last year? That, I did. that guy looks fucking scary as shit, dude. It looks like a horror film. Yeah, this, I, the only thing I saw about this was that he's the only one that wore red in the entire movie because of the fact that it makes him look like a goddamn nut job. <laughs> it does. Yeah. Was there a cricket in it? I think so. Jimmy, Jimmy? Jiminy Cricket was in it. I think one of the issues, though, was that uh, Geppetto just kept sitting on Pinocchio's nose. And just, <laughs> all right. Hey, there we go. Hey, move around a bit. Don't lie. Yeah. This, oh, this can't be the cast, right? 
What? This cast is fucking stacked. Read it. Who I don't got? know anything about it. Fucking Ewan McGregor. Okay. That's Christoph, Pinocchio. Christoph That's where Waltz. Been. What? Waltz? Who does he Swinton, play? Who does he Kate play? Blanchett, Ron Perlman. This is a cast. Holy shit. Hold the phone. Is Hellboy in this? Fucking mm-hmm. Ewan McGregor plays Jiminy Cricket. Does he really? Yeah. Who plays Geppetto? Um, <laughs> who plays Pinocchio? Where's uh, David Bradley. I'm not sure who that is. Yeah. Pinocchio. Christoph Waltz playing. Pinocchio's some, Pinocchio's some guy named fucking Pinocchio. Gregory Man. <laughs> fucking Kevin um, Hart. Quite a film. Maybe this like is another... Pinocchio. Maybe they spent too much on the cast and they couldn't afford it was, to more. It was written it by all. and directed yeah. by Guillermo del Toro. What? What the hell? How haven't I heard about this? Tell me, are you making this no, up? No, I'll fucking... <laughs> that Pinocchio is awesome. Yeah, the original Pinocchio. <laughs> what was that? Pinocchio. <laughs> okay. That's what your pal calls him. Uh-huh. Tony. <laughs> Tony. Tony. What's going on, Tony? What the hell are you None talking about, None of these names about, on this Tony. list are any of the names you just Hold read. On. Zito found the wrong one. Yeah, yeah, this, one cool. this one is 2019, it says. Zito, I'm sending you the That was the one, right? This one that I'm sending you is 2021. Is so this like a new one? I don't think that one's We're come out. in 2021, pal. Yeah. But it wouldn't be up for the Oscars if it got released. Yeah, that's the one I'm... Could oh. be. Yeah, this is a different one. Because a movie that came out in there's no way Z, z- zoom in on there's that no cast way list. Guillermo del Toro. <laughs> no, I know, that but that's a different movie. Cast, oh, and so we this didn't one, hear about so it. Yeah, you're right. a, zoom in on that. So that this one hasn't come out yet. Oh, it's an animated one too. Uh, uh, I'm, I'm in on this one. Though. Yeah, so am I. Yeah. Oh, what was the scroll up? What was the um? What was the synopsis? There was a a darker version of the classic children's fairy tale of a wooden puppet that transforms into real. Yeah, I'm a real boy. That looks fucking sweet. Is Pinocchio just going to be chopping people's heads off he or might, something? He might be. Yeah. Who's uh, playing for the- this movie, this is the cast list. We don't know much. Okay, so for the one that... So th- this is an Italian film. Roberto like. Benigni. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Well, it's a story about... Oh, now I have to watch it. What is this rated? I'm glad we got to the bottom of that. Fucking X. A triple X. Yeah. <laughs> Pinocchio. <laughs> oh, what's next? Oh, shit. I hate this. Terrifying new species of venomous spider discovered in Miami that looks like a small, shiny black tarantula and can live for over 20 years. It's venom. Eliminate them. Eliminate them all. Burn down the forest. Yeah. These are what's known as a trapdoor spider. Mm-hmm. So they burrow into the ground, cover themselves with leaves and sticks, and then jump out. So it's the Rambo spiders? Are you fucking kidding me, dude? I'm never going to Miami again. Uh-uh. Yeah, Jesus. can't. It's they only can't a matter of time it. for these things spread. To- Why are they shiny? We need winter. Attract it. But no, what's that shiny thing? Oh, <laughs> We're going to have to sacrifice yeah, exactly. somewhere to kill these things. Yeah. Imagine how much of a squish it makes when you squish you, it. You think oh. like fucking you could just get some Scott's Turf Builder Plus and spray it on these things and just get know. rid of them? I, probably. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. This question. thing looks powerful. That's always my answer to everything. Might just get bigger, stronger. Yeah, you're right. Uh, what's your choice of weapon against this thing? A Fucking fifty caliber machine gun. Tennis racket. Flame. Tennis racket? You think that's doing the trick? Huh. Yeah, you'd be like, I was gonna say that. you're running over that thing with that dagum lawnmower. You take the Z turn over a couple of these things. Oh, yeah, yeah, Flamethrower yeah. maybe. What if yeah. it jumps at you? A ball and chain mace. <laughs> yep. That'd be good. That's a hell of a wind up. That's just flamethrower. Like the, the backside of a shovel. That's good. And you just step you, on it. You guys are sleeping on the tennis racket. It will it that thing. Will slice the tennis racket will slice right through its body and we leave don't it know how long a thousand square. You gotta get close. What do you think this thing's made of jello? <laughs> Trust me. I put um, metal weed whacker wire. Hell yeah! As my tennis wire. Uh huh. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Okay. You're standing ten feet away and you're just yeah. okay. You're, this but if bad. it's on you, you're not gonna fucking flame your foot. Well, I'm not getting that close to it. You have to. No way. I'll I, flame I, my flamethrower. Listen, if it if it's flaming my foot or getting bit by this thing, I'll flame my fucking foot. No flame way. your foot. No. What's next? <laughs> Connor McGregor impersonator <laughs> busted for selling drugs. I mean, kind of. Who the fuck is flame. that guy? <laughs> uh, Mystic Crack work. is a notorious drug dealer in the UK. Uh, and he was apparently pulled over and caught with some narcotics and uh, tried to get out of it. I'm Connor McGregor. Um, Dude, you're 45 years old. You're not McGregor. <laughs> is this the guy who punched the old man in the bar? It might be. <laughs> yeah. 
we've had the wrong guy all along. <laughs> it wasn't me. This guy that showed his penis in France. <laughs> this is McGregor, like, if he was, like, 8-8 eight and eight in the MMA and had to retire and then got into some meth. Yeah. Still possible. But I like what... It, <laughs> I like what he's doing, though. I mean, yeah, you got to use your looks to your advantage, and this guy does. I mean, he looks like a McGregor doppelganger. Are we sure that's not his dad? He looks like Ed McGregor. <laughs> he looks like someone tried to make Conor McGregor out of clay. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and got bored halfway through. <laughs> yeah. I wish we could see, like, chin down, because, like, obviously he's got, like, the tattoos and shit. Oh, you if think he got dude, the same tattoos? If this dude had, like, a knockoff, yeah, like a knockoff monkey on his chest or if something. If he's any impersonator worth his salt, he at least has some f- phony tattoos on there. Yeah, they're just right. spilling out. What's next? Uh, I guess there's a video in here. Is there volume for this? Oh, okay, yeah, so uh, no volume. This is uh, because we talked about the bobcat last episode. This is another video of a bobcat doing tremendous athletic feats, jumping across piers. Oh, oh shit. Holy Holy shit. Fuck. shit. Yeah. I'm still killing this thing. Z. Z, you're not killing Did you them. see that? The bobcat, dude. The They're just that's, that's deadlier a- house cats. Oh, man. Dude, I'm fucking grabbing that mid high ground. He has, I have high ground. I'm killing it. See, that's why I want a Bengal cat. Just to watch it do that shit. Oh, yeah. What happened to cocaine? Um... Was that its name? <laughs> Kilo. That. Kilo. Kilo. <laughs> Kilo, dude. Kilo. I like where your brain's at, though. Yeah. <laughs> You're a dead eye. was right there. Uh, oh, we just put that on the back burner. <laughs> we'll see We'll see Kilo <laughs> down the road. Uh, man, I really wish you would have got that fucking cat. Hey, never say never. It ain't over yet. No, but also, not. after almost getting scammed uh, buying a dog, I am assuming that Bengal cat site was all <laughs> bullshit. Oh, yeah, they're selling uh, you a bobcat. Yeah, yeah, there's no chance that that was real. What's next? Yep. Okay, here we go. Let's go. Nearly 3.8 million U.S. households watched Mortal Kombat during its opening weekend. That's good news for the home TV and movie watchers, boys. I love Cyber Uh, Mortal Kombat had more viewership in just three days than Godzilla vs. Kong got in its first five. Gotcha. That's flawless victory. That part was awesome. What do we think about the film? I think my thoughts are pretty well known. I talked about it a little bit on Twitter. Didn't love it. Yeah, but I think that was because we hyped it up a lot, mm-hmm. and you know, it was, oh, you don't want dialogue? No, I don't want dialogue. It's just like some semblance of a plot. Yeah, and I felt like the kills were cool, but really only like I liked Kano, I liked Kano's, the Kung Lao kill, Kano uh-huh. was sweet, and Goro, but there wasn't enough Goro because I didn't realize it was a Mickey Mouse budget film. I thought they uh, pumped money into was this not thing. Mickey what are you Mouse. talking about, dude? No. Um, it was it was a it was a B movie. I had to come. It was a low budget movie. I had to uh, look myself in the mirror this morning because I knew this was going to be talked about and say, "Hey, Tony, are you going to be real with the people, or are you going to be an asshole?" You're always real with the people, and I'm always real with the people. Was it an incredible movie? Yes. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Was the acting as good as it possibly could have been? You're not showing up in Mortal Kombat for the acting. Maybe no. Exactly. Zeke's right. The main character was kind of a piece of shit. He had no business Cole, being there. You didn't need to make up a, a main character when you got a franchise. There wasn't a lot of <laughs> sixty to seventy characters. There wasn't throughout. a lot of depth to the main character. He stunk. You can say it's fine. No, 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 no. But was the kills? Were the kills fucking awesome? Yes. Yes. Hell yeah. I didn't Lots. like what they did. The reptile. Luke. They made Luke Kang kind of a bitch. Kung Lao's table Kang. saw finish was fucking dope. That yeah. was sweet. Yeah. It was unbelievable. That was awesome. I mean, Jax all Scorpion's kills were fucking sweet. Jax's yeah. tiny little arms were funny. Those were hysterical. Yeah, I saw uh, the Jason Moe commercial as a meme of that. Yeah. That was sweet. <laughs> Unfortunately, the two characters that they spent the most time with, the the new guy and then Sonya Blade, those two kind of stunk. They did. Yeah. yeah. So, like I said, we watched the first seven minutes of it on Twitter. Awesome. It was released ahead of time. That was, that was awesome. The Sub Zero uh, Scorpion storyline was awesome. I thought it would play into that a little bit more. I didn't think it would go yeah. down like the Bloodline route. I, I thought they just should have just stuck with that more. And like Scorpion was so cool, and they they seldomly used them. I guess so. It was like Sub Zero was pretty cool. He was. He was sweet. But those are like the best guys. So it's like, why yeah. are we not focusing on them and making them like the key? Yes. But so yeah, to so your point, Sub Zero started off the movie as such a boss, and then all of a sudden he became Shang Tsung's fucking lackey. Yeah, I, I just I don't know. 
Do you think that you would rate this the same? Like, I have a certain rating for this being a, ho- a movie I watched at home and then a movie, I th- like, if I would have watched it in theaters. I think I have two different ratings. Absolutely. I'd have been pissed if I saw this in theaters. Pissed. I would have been so fucking Like, mad. I think it was like Wait, a, was a, a 7 movie. out of 10 yeah, watching but. it at home, and I think it would have been like a 5 <laughs> if I would have watched it in theaters. No, that, that's well said. Yeah. Absolutely. I'm, yeah, Bill, I think you just hit the nail on the head there. But it kept my attention. You know, yeah, that, yeah, that's the biggest thing. There was no point where I was like, all right, fuck this, or like wanted to skip forward. Like, it kept my attention. Yeah, sure, there were some Mickey Mouse parts, but yeah. they had awesome kills. For, for not going to Mortal Kombat and actually doing the tournament. That was what made they, me. They, like, that was movie. the only thing that was like, that oh, was shit. The, but the next movie, when they go to Mortal Kombat, yes. and they, it was just an introduction. Yeah. It doesn't even they seem like the they're going to get there the next movie, though. <laughs> Well, they have to now. I, yeah. it's, it's, no, it's they're like, going to L.A. They've, they've won yeah. nine tournaments in a row. So now they're going to kill everyone before the last tournament? It didn't make any sense. It was like, well, I know it's not supposed to make sense. It's a video game movie, but like... Uh, the storyline wasn't story incredible. Line. It's also still a movie, you know? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I got to run back out and finish this, but I, it just, like, it just wasn't great. It just wasn't great. And it held my attention. I watched the whole fucking thing. Mm-hmm. I did. You know, you can't... You can't fucking dangle Scorpion like that. And then can't just, and then just not show... Like, that. you guys said it. I mean, that main character stunk. He stunk. His yeah. his skills stunk. I mean, the kill on Goro was really sweet. Awesome. Amazing. Really sweet. But there's just too much bullshit in there. I, I also to, feel like they picked some lame bad guys. Like, for Cabal. a movie... Yeah, like, Cabal yeah. and that, that General Rinko dude. Like, yeah. they yeah, just made all the stunk. Like, He's lame. about to get his soul sucked. Yeah, that, what they should have done awesome. is... They should have... I mean, you're right. They should have fucking... Came out swinging with all the big characters. Well, no, yeah, that's what number two is about, though. Yeah, Set but the table. They're gonna get half the amount of fucking viewers for number two. Well, no, it's you're you're mm-hmm. introducing Johnny Cage. Everyone wanted him in this movie. No, nah, no, nah, when you're doing this and you're rebooting something that people really enjoy, you can't leave anything. In you gotta have the heavy hitters. Bust it out to start yeah. and then be inventive on the on the well, flip side. They're trying to go like against that though. They're trying to do the second one brings all the juice now. Yeah, but why are you relying on the second one to bring the juice when you're trying to reinvent the franchise? Like, I saw someone said that they signed, like, the guy who's playing Sub-Zero signed to, like, a four-movie deal. Yeah. It's like, how can you get... There you go. I'm all in. Like, then let's make sure that the first one is fucking awesome so it justifies having an entire new franchise. Like, it, you just, you can't leave any bullets so in the chamber. And that, that, that right there is a spoiler because yeah, now spoiler I know right. he's not dead. But, hey, whoa. knowing that, whoa, though, whoa, whoa, whoa. knowing that Sub-Zero is going to be a part of the next four movies... I would have had the bad guys go over in Mortal Kombat 1. That's true. I would have had the bad guys fucking set it up for yeah. the next movie. Yeah. Next movie is that now fucking, you know, the, the Shadow Realm people, they own the Earth. Yeah. We got to go to L.A. We got to get fucking ball-punching Johnny Cage. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I yeah. like that, actually. And just, like, the main character, too. Like, the guy just, what, he just stinks the whole movie, and then all of a sudden, like, you know, Goro, Goro's about to boink his wife, so he gets pissed and turns yeah. into that guy. Like, it just... Here's just my don't buy it. Bracelet, dude. The wife... His Kung Lao dead. The wife and daughter were way too fucking... Oh, yeah. um, yeah, soul suck. Soul suck. They were way too ballsy, by the way. Just standing out there? Yeah. They're Who's fighters, bad? baby. But they knew fucking their Papa Cole had their back. You're right. You know? And his power, which was what? In taking his, a beating? and then His batons. Yeah, you know, he had the, the Black the, Panther suit, dude. And the batons, <laughs> but they were actually knives. Yeah. It did hold my attention. I watched the whole thing. I watched the whole I, thing, I, thing like too. I turned it off. Or Who anything, played Scorpion? Hanzo. Hanzo. No, that was his name. Uh, Hiyoshi Hasako. He, he's about, the, well, the most well-known I actor out of all that. We yeah, talked about he's done a bunch of stuff. He was in Endgame. And a couple other films. For who? Mm-hmm. The guy who played Scorpion. Well, he's not fucking more known than fucking calculations. He was in Westworld, too. I do oh, think he is. Okay. He, yeah, yeah he was in Westworld. <laughs> the Samurai. I don't think there's no way he's more known than calculations. I do believe he is. <laughs> I'm very good at calculations. <laughs> well, if he would have said, I'm very good at Mortal Kombat. <laughs> he should have said that. Well, that's what I was saying, too, is, like, Shang Tsung in the games is pretty sweet because he can fucking morph into any character whenever he wants. Like, what did he do in this one? Suck the soul. That's it. I understand that you didn't get the full home run, but you did get a taste of it. And you know what they could do with number two. I don't remember fucking robot uh, fucking... Jump from place to place, Cabal. guy. Yeah, he was. A, he came in the later games, and then Raiden. They made Raiden like a whiny bitch. Well, he can't. He can't interfere. You know that. He's God. Yeah. Which also is another thing they didn't show, which is going to be sweet when they get to it in the fifth movie. <laughs> <laughs> Would you be all Fifth in or movie. all out if they added like Rambo and fucking Terminator and stuff like this, like they do in the games? 
I think that'd be a little Mickey Mouse. Yeah. Yeah. To like ask for you know other characters. So we're talking Ready Player One. I want to see a T one thousand go in there and just fucking destroy everyone. Well, I still think it'd be sweet if they just invented more characters. So they did. Cole Young, baby. I know, I continue to do that, but not <laughs> Cole Young. <laughs> I mean, at least, he could have at least been like a good at MMA, too. That was Mickey Mouse getting beat. In like a backyard fight. It's like, what the hell is this? Do we like Jack? Stadiums on you. Only fight. you'll get beat for $200 on short notice. <laughs> yeah. It's like, come on. I like Jack. See? He had a cool finish. Yeah. That was pretty sweet. Yeah, yeah these motherfuckers work. He said something like that. <laughs> when he was trying, he's like, these aren't me. When they were tiny. It was hysterical. Tiny ass arms. <laughs> these aren't me. Like, no, they're not because they look like fucking R2-D2's buddies, whatever uh, the fuck, C-3PO's arms. See, in the original, though, he takes his arms off. And that was like, remember that like in the movies, the original movies? Yeah. That was like, oh, you gotta use your normal powers. And then it was just, it sucked. Saber from American Gladiators. He was the original Jax. Really? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Saber. Oh, yeah. Saber, dude. Saber Tooth Tiger. Tyrannosaurus. But yeah, I'm all in on Mortal Kombat, too. I mean, they'll definitely make another one with how many yet. people watched it, but. Oh, yeah. I wonder how much, did, does anyone know how much money it made in theaters? Probably, Probably $10 billion. Not much. Yeah, I don't know how much. I just. I want to say 9.8. Uh, over the weekend, but really? I I can't remember if that was this or Kong. I, I read something about it, but I, I might be getting them mixed up. Is HBO Max fifteen bucks a month or five? Fifteen, 15. I believe. Yeah, yeah, so I just figure you can just I'll lump that in there. Quick, yeah, just do that real quick. And I tell you what, man, when 50. they had, when they had the Jax General Dildo, whatever the fuck his name was, that fight uh, in the pit level, I really wanted Jax to hit the uppercut, uppercut fatality, and yeah. he just drops into the spice. nine million oh, opening day. Uh, yeah, twenty three million over. Uh, the first That's not week. bad. That's just theaters. Yeah. So you factor in the 50 plus there. Yeah. Well, that's like have they announced million. how many subscribers HBO Max has? Uh, I don't know. I saw like, like a bar graph. I'm not sure. And you'll shit. never get a real number anyways, yeah, yeah. right? It's all. I mean, if they keep doing easy. this, it's going to go up. Like if, if they start just releasing. Five days ago, it said it was up from 41 and a half million to something else. 53.8. Well, a lot. well wow. what's next too is Dune next is oh Dune? yeah because when that comes out that's gonna be huge Space movie, Jam whenever that fucking comes yeah, out July right Space uh-huh. Jam no I mean, hopefully Dune? Dune's next month Dune what did you say before Space Jam Dune's gonna be Dune. sick Dune's dude. gonna be dope with like Zendaya Oh, yeah, yeah. This to Oscar me Isaac, almost felt Batista. like they could have yeah. done Timothy. Mortal Kombat as like a series yeah, the yeah, way you know, Falcon and Winter Soldier. Kind of, yeah, yeah. It made it like six, seven, eight episodes yeah. and did a couple seasons of it. I felt oh. like they could have ran that for a while. Easily. Because it, like, it didn't seem like the special effects, and so it didn't seem like it was like crazy. That's why I said it probably didn't have a big budget because yeah. it seemed kind of rinky dink. Did mm-hmm. you see Sonya's fucking arms shoot out those lasers? That, yeah, was sweet. that was sweet. That was cool, dude. That was sweet. Yeah. But you're right, because they tried to fit in a backstory for each character within yeah. the movie. I was Correct. like, look, there are too many goddamn characters here. Just fucking get to it. Let me see some fucking blood on the screen, please. Yeah, you could have like one of the season finales be like a tournament. You could have mm-hmm. all this stuff <laughs> leading up to so, it. Yeah. But whatever. What's next? Yeah, these motherfuckers work. That was, that was awesome. Speaking of series, uh, House of the Dragon officially Let's begun production go. and released in 2022. The Game of Thrones prequel that will focus on Can't the wait. Targaryen family All 300 in. years I'm before. Very pumped. All in. Westeros. Very pumped. Who's writing this fucking thing? I think I don't know. It's not Benioff and Weiss, right? They didn't bring no. those guys back. Nope. They're did done with them. You, did you guys read the, the accounting uh, firm of Benny Off and Weiss? The accounting firm of Benny Off and Weiss will be handling the House of the Dragon. The uh, I can't wait for this. I read the book. The book is fucking incredible. I didn't the, read this the, one. The Chronicles of the uh, of the Targaryen family. I can't. The title escapes me. So I'm pumped, man. Very, 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 very excited to did see. Did the fat bearded guy write the book? George? Yeah, George Double R. Martin. Not yeah, there he yet. still hasn't fucking released the Winds of Winter, but at least he can do all the other side shit. Wait, so wh- he wrote a prequel before finishing the series? Yeah. That's Badass. <laughs> it's badass. Good for that guy. And I'm tired of writing this one. Yeah, I'm t- going back to the star fucking. It's, it's pretty. In, it's pretty uh, in depth, man. Like the the different generations of the Targaryens that they fucking touch on. Targaryens have a badass lineage. I think if I were to get myself in that realm, I would want to be a Targaryen. I can't wait. Yeah, no, absolutely. Oh, fuck your sister. Yeah, incest is okay. Yeah. I mean, if you can't keep it, it in cool, your pants, man. keep it in the family, right? Yeah. <laughs> can't be burned. Yeah, I'd absolutely be a Targaryen. Gumpy, you gonna watch this? 
I mean, I should probably watch Game of Thrones first, right? You don't need to know. I don't know. I think you start here and then go into Game of Thrones. Go. I'll watch it with you guys. Here we go. Is it just one season or is it? Uh, I'd imagine they have to stretch this thing out. Three or four? I could see a couple. Yeah, it's got to be more than one. What's next? As long as it ends with the wedding. Oh, here we go. Could Mike Lowry and Burnett, I don't even know the other character's Marcus. name. Marcus Burnett from Bad Boys have brought down Dom Toretto's crew. Has there ever been <laughs> a bigger mismatch? I don't think so. Ever? <laughs> Fucking fly versus windshield, dude. Mm-hmm. Not a chance. Yeah, the, 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 this here. was even tweeted as disgusting. They fucking <laughs> barely brought down Tapia. Tell uh, I mean, hold on. Tell your jokes, Will. Barely brought down Tapia. The guy was a fucking drug lord. Listen, I love Johnny Tapia, but I mean, they needed help from all other agencies and the Cuban government and stuff like that. That's true. If fucking Dewey Johnson can't bring down Toretto, I'm sorry, but true, true. They don't got a chance. Very true. Not a chance. Not even close. Hmm. I'm glad it's universal and unanimous, Zeet. But Zito thinks they can. Zeet. No, I, I did not send this in or say that. But who sent this in? I sent this in. But Zito is uh, oh, on so. right now. I hear him back there. No, I, I am. I am thinking right now because Will is good behind a car. Are you shitting me? No, I mean, yeah, dude, he, he's not even oh, close. We got a, what, what is that? What the fuck is that? We got a beast in here. That's what a flying creature. Whoa, whoa, is that a whoa, moth? Whoa, whoa. That's a moth. Oh, fuck. That's not a moth, That ain't dude. a moth. That's fucking ah! Lowry. That's Lowry against dude, Dom Toretto, dude. Get it out dude. Dude, get King it out. Deidre. Yeah, that's a, big, that's a big one. Holy shit. It's real big. Bill! <laughs> <laughs> Kill it, Bill! Bill, eat this thing. Is Bill, get your gun. It's going over by Tony. Jesus Christ! Good lord. Fuck, it's attracting the lights. It likes the yeah, lights. That's, that's, <laughs> that is definitely not a moth. That's It's a bee, isn't it? That is a big... That's probably... It might be a wasp or a If hornet. it's a bee, can't kill it and eat them. Yeah, you can't kill a bee. We have to save it. It's not a bee. Kill it. <laughs> it's gone. Fuck. All right, what's next? Hey, I just discussed That was electric. Uh, someone caught their neighbor stealing their other neighbor's lazy spa <laughs> on his bike. This is mitt. <laughs> yeah. This is gonna be you guys leaving the pub. He just back, jacked this thing up, stuck it on his head, start pedaling away. Good for him. Commitment. Yeah. I mean, you kind of have to. This guy should get a guy. fucking medal of honor, dude. He's gonna have a nice soak later. Safe like, to workout. say, he lives in the neighborhood because he knows his route. Ooh. Well said. Oh. Zeke. Oh, yeah. Here comes the hero. Oh, Bill's got a broom. All hail the conquering hero. All right, Bill. Bill don't hey, don't fuck. break anything. Good luck, Bill. Yeah, you're going to bring down the lights. Don't break anything, Bill. Be an asshole. Good luck, Bill. Bill. That bee looks like it's on the fucking gas. That broom's not going to do much to it. Yeah, it, 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 flew, it flew up there above the <laughs> this clock. This is going to be literally Chris Farley just, bees! Bill's going to swing the fucking broom. The bee's going to catch it and chase him out of here with the fucking broom. Uh, Stay ready, Bill. That thing might build a nest in the next hour. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Yeah, we got anything for this? I don't. I can't pay attention. <laughs> I, yeah, Tony's got a certain put your fucking his beekeeper head. suit on. Tony. Yeah, yeah, shit, yeah, that's right. Little... You're a genius. You're and an then, absolute genius. And then grab the behind room. there. I'll be right back. And then grab the broom. Continue, continue on with the show. And kill. Him. Sure. What's right. next? Tony's going to get the beekeeper suit. Oh, some crinkle cut fries. They stink. Oh. People who Whoa, eat no. french fries or hash browns two to three times a week were more likely to die early, according Whoa. to this. Uh, to preface real quick, I did bring fries uh, to your Easter gathering. Yep. You brought and everyone cuts. ate it. I loved them. Well, they I love the only cut. fry option, so they were forced to, yeah. Yeah, but everyone ate it, though. <laughs> I'm a crinkle cut guy. Love crinkle cut fries. Yeah, I don't Really? Oh, yeah. yeah. Come on, guys. <laughs> they're good. Have some self-respect. They're yeah, good. No, they're pretty, pretty good. They're not better than waffles. They're not better than curlies. No, no. no. But, but those are special. I, actually, I will take them over a curly fry. I do, like a, I do like a crinkle cut over a curly Really? Fry. Yeah. Arby's oh, yeah, curly oh, fries? Thing. We're not sponsored by them anymore. You don't have to keep fucking selling them. I oh. love... Oh, come on. Arby's curly dude. fry, no matter what. Arby's it's actually delicious. has crinkle cut fries now, and I'm not happy about what? it. What? The crinkle is good. They man. do, yeah. Do they have? They don't have Nathan's hot dogs out here, right? No, so I knew. I knew. I knew it was some east, fucking yeah. Coney Island bullshit. Exactly. Me. Back east, man. Uh, Nathan's Nathan's hot dogs. <laughs> they're <laughs> fucking crinkle cut fries with that little red like pitchfork thing they give you. It's a delicious treat. Also, White Castle has king uh, 
Crinkle cut fries. This isn't the 1930s anymore. Dude. What are we talking about? Crinkle cuts. Are We're going down to the mall shop and having crinkle cut fries. Yeah. <laughs> I don't hate crinkle cuts. They're not my first choice, but I don't fucking hate Far them. from your first choice. Tony, where's the uh, suit? I mean, you need a good amount of salt. Uh, you, I had to take my shoes off to put it on. I didn't want to find it. That's right. Taking my shoes off. <laughs> I guess stick your foot. What's next? This has really gone off the rails here with this B. Oh, that studio or that um, that those fries. What did it say? Like two to three times a week. You're, yeah, you're dead. Yeah, it's What happens you if you can't believe seven times a week? Yeah, it, you might live longer. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Well, you can't trust WebMD. If you tell WebMD that you've been sneezing, it'll tell you you have cancer. True. WebMD is <laughs> son of a bitch. Very much true. OnlyFans is still crushing. Revenue has grown 553 percent, up to 390 million in the year. Can you buy stock? Its user base grew from less than Not 20 yet. million to more than 120 million, and over 300 <laughs> creators earned more than 1 million bucks in 2020. These 300 millionaires Whoa. from OnlyFans is the part that got me. Really? That's that's like the least surprising thing to me. I'm more surprised by the, the 20 million to 120 million. That is a lot. When that is gonna, a lot. When are we going to make the move to just put our fucking show on OnlyFans? What are you going to pull out our fuck fucking penis and slap them on the fucking. Though. We don't have to get fucking naked. It's like just like Patreon. When you are you know? gonna? No, put, it's not. When yeah. are you gonna rebrand the Billy? Respect to the yeah. OnlyFans. You're not going on OnlyFans and not putting your penis on the table, dude. <laughs> Billy Baloney. We just got to decorate with all those fucking cock uh, cock plants that Zito brought in the other day. Oh the yeah. That's just Ron Jeremy actually in the wall. <laughs> <laughs> hey Ron. <laughs> hey hey Connor. <laughs> <laughs> Squeeze me! <laughs> 300 people making a million bucks is wild. That, That's I mean, a million bucks a pop, or is that 300 creators? People love at least. People, as, you know what? As we found out a little over a year ago, people love boobs. Porn's booming. <laughs> and it ain't never coming down. People dude. love dumping them out. That's right. <laughs> and people love watching people dump them out. Dump out. I mean, didn't Bad Bobby do like a million in a day? On yeah. Like her 18th birthday, right? Yeah. And I don't even think she dumped him out. I think she just... Was... Nah, she didn't. She did the uh, route of the um, <laughs> blended girl. How hey, did you enjoy the show, Tony? Or, uh, was it a good show or was it just kind of Mickey Mouse? Nah, it was Mickey Mouse. What's the blended girl's name? Uh, Is that the one that the tricked everyone? Um, she was in Blended, the fucking movie she with that. She has red hair, right? And... Oh, uh, shit. She's a, she was a Disney, like... Girl Bella? Too. Bella, Bella Thorn. Yeah. Uh, oh. What's next? Who's your least favorite TV character of all time? Skyler. Yeah. Skyler. Easy. Dude, Ross Geller does not. No, I was talking about the Breaking Bad yeah, wife. Yeah, Breaking Bad wife. Hundred percent. Oh, no, I change yeah. it. Um, daughter from Homeland. <laughs> wife, from wife from Homeland stunk too. What? Whoa, dude! Oh, she what's did. Her from Deadpool? she was fucking uh, buddies. His buddy, the sergeant. Was, yeah. Well, whose fault was that? Brody was a fucking yeah, Brody was sleeper dead. cell, dude. Was, Don't get off. What was his daughter name? Daughter Carrie's daughter in Homeland. No, not Carrie's daughter. TV character. Uh, I hated Nelly in the office. Dana. Fucking Dana uh, Brody. Nelly? Nelly kind of She stunk. did stink. That is tough, yeah. I'm trying to think who else. Um, fucking Michael Rappaport and Friends, probably. <laughs> <laughs> probably him. Uh, you want to move in together? Also, uh, hold on, there's a bird. Also, uh, <laughs> fucking Game of Thrones, Targaryen's brother. Oh, uh, kid, Vis- fucking Viserys. Sucked. Yeah. But he died, so it was kind of awesome. Did you guys ever watch Power? Joffrey? How did you feel about Joffrey? Oh, he was the best heel. Yeah, I like Joffrey because of how committed he was. Yeah. So so, about, Viserys, so, you wanted to fucking just slap him right in the stupid Pete, face. What about Pete Campbell for Mad Men? Oh, that's in the last two. No, nah, Pete grew on me. He started off as a little Weasley prick, but he he, he grew on me near the end. How the wife in power stunk. I've never seen power. It's how a good about, show. How about this Ross Keller motherfucker? Ted Mosby from How I Met Your Mother. <laughs> oh, man. I never got into How I Met Your Mother. I liked I it. I watched it all. It's pretty good, but I watched some reruns here and there, but I never like got all the way in. I'm trying to, I'm scrolling through worst characters. He's just desperate of all time. for love. I mean, that's this list. You have to take. Yeah, off I saw Michael Scott on yeah. the list. So really? what? No, oh my. What God. about Kimmy Gibbler? Oh, Ross is on this on the list. That makes sense. Actually, the list is back. People hate Ross. I don't he know stinks, why. Ross is dude. great. I think he's hilarious. Sheldon Cooper. R- Ross steals the show, especially in the later seasons. Oh, I'll tell you, yeah. I didn't like Frasier. Screech? No. And I oh, like Kelsey Keys. Grammer, but I did not like Frasier. Why is George Costanza on this list? I, that, well, that's criminal. This stinks. Yeah, I'm off. I'm fucking Scrappy Goo? 
What? Oh, give him a break. Is that Mitt's list? <laughs> no, I love Scrappy. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Frazier's on this list. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Fucking all of her trash from the OC makes gr- a lot of sense. Mm-hmm. What's next? Um, <gasps> a new Monsterverse what? film is in the works. One possible title being floated internally is Son of Kong. What does that mean? Oh. Did Godzilla and Kong have sex? <laughs> Cross pollination. I think Godzilla banged the little girl. Or, oh, I'm sorry, shit. Kong banged the little girl. Jesus. <laughs> she grows up, obviously. Okay, okay. You mean like that Riley Reed meme? Nice save. <laughs> Which one? Which meme, Tony? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> He's so worried about this beat. I am too. My head, dude. Um, <laughs> That's probably the same size as the pterodactyl. Tony, so, are they reaching here? Have they reached the bottom of the well? Or they, is like it, it. Has it run dry? What's going well, on? Well, I feel like they're... Mm, I feel like part of me thinks Godzilla versus Kong should have come before Godzilla, King of the Monsters, but we could have made King of the Monsters a different name. Because, like, that should have been the end game when all the monsters were there. Yeah. Like, you got to see them all. They I all think I'm fought. With you. I think I'm riding with you here. So you're saying two should have been better than one, like Mortal Kombat. Yes. Exactly. Hmm. Hmm. So what I was saying before, and you guys are disagreeing. I don't know what he's saying. No, <laughs> you're saying two because will be better than one. Yeah. Well, I in just, this case, he's saying one should have been better like than two. Kong and Godzilla should have fought... Ghidra. Hmm. So don't there was use, a better way for them to do it. Don't use all your characters at right away. There should better. have been a bigger monster in the underworld that like followed Kong back up. Hmm. That's what I think. I was just so disappointed with the last one. I can't get over it. Yeah. It's stuck. But Ty, what do you think about Son of Kong? I haven't watched the last one yet. I'm sure uh, if Kong's in it, it's gonna be awesome though. <laughs> well, I don't think it is Kong. No, it's his son. Well, is he still big? <laughs> yeah. yeah, I'll watch it. He's probably going to be pretty big. If he's big, I'll watch it. <laughs> or is this Kong's dad? This fucking thing is up oh. here sucking energy from this light, dude. <laughs> what? And you it's going to be there? fucking... Yeah, Stop crying about the bee and do something, dude. Six inches tall, but it's... Hit. Show yourself! <laughs> oh, it's on your hat! Oh, my... <laughs> Like, <laughs> it did not show itself. That's a nice hat. So you said that and I didn't believe you, but then, the, but then this. Uh, you gotta touch. That's, that's this what thing. threw me off. I thought I that saw was the it bee. through. Yeah, I thought that was the bee. My uh, straw hat season, dude. It's not even a straw hat though. I just touched it. It is a nice hat. Thank you. I know that. Do we all what like straw that, hat? I think Fucking Nick doesn't. American like it. hat Gator? company knows it. World champion. Fucking World Roper champion. Roper Shane Roper Shane Shane. Shane. It might be Gator. <laughs> it might be Gator. It feels awesome. Don't worry about what it is. It's a python skin. Oh, corn husk. What's next? <laughs> okay, here we go. A couple big uh, drug busts. Palm Beach, Florida, over the weekend, a beachgoer discovered over $1.5 million worth of cocaine washed up on the shoreline. Beachgoer? Sheesh. Sheesh. Is right. Fucking Chad Haynes back at it again. <laughs> <laughs> also, uh, they also found a 5,000-pound... Uh, 5,000 pounds of coke in a uh, semi-submersible oh, craft nice. uh-huh. near yeah, Puerto Rico. Cool. I love when they make these fucking homemade submarines. They get caught a lot. Yeah. Well, that's a dangerous game, my friend. This, this is the one they, the want, ocean, though. they want to get caught. They have like exactly. seven different ones that are fucking are way better. Yeah. Exactly. Oh, so like oh, we got them. I like where your head's at there. Make them think you got them. Yeah, they got the big bust, but really they just got a fucking. There's a bunch of flowers there. Away, baby. Yeah, they got a fucking throwaway bust. Exactly. That is, I mean, there's not enough. Coke That's there. coke, baby. No, and if it's a big one, guess what? That thing definitely has a trip wire set to it, so they're never even opening the sub the submersible. Correct. Uh, you know, I also that love that the cops like tweet them out like, "Hey, we did it. We got them. Check it out. Check out what we landed. Cartel is going to be pissed." <laughs> What's that symbol on that kilo? Looks like a, a lion or a fox. A lion. It looks like a horse. A horse a could donkey, be a horse. Maybe? Donkey. I respect people still doing the coke though. Yeah, coke will never die. I'm gonna look Where confused. They it Why is Palm it Beach? white? Yeah, one was Palm Beach. The other one was near Puerto Rico. Why is white? Is this not white? No, it's wrapped. It's wrapped. A couple yeah. times. Oh, like sushi. Yeah, yeah. 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 
Gotta yeah. keep the water that's out. So, that's mm-hmm. soy paper. Yeah. There it is. Otherwise, you get a bunch of fish all fucking hopped up. Yeah. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. And then you don't want that. It's salmon again. Imagine fucking sharks geeked up on cocaine. Uh, uh, no, thank you. Is it, are you disappointed when it's salmon? What'd you say? Are you disappointed when it's salmon? No, I love salmon. Oh, okay. Salmon I, I think I like good. tuna more, though. I, I don't know. Tuna and salmon are the go-tos. Tuna fish? I love crab. So do I. Yeah, but crab's lobster. are like... Where's my lobster money? Crab's like, if you don't really like sushi, though. When's the last time you guys had a tuna melt? California. Tuna kind of stinks, I think. No, I like tuna. I don't really love tuna. Tuna melt I haven't had in decades. See, tuna, raw tuna, tuna is very, very different than tuna. Oh, uh, the two sandwich. That was the all-time fucking Brian Earl Spillner line. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no one likes the tuna first, here. First Fast and Furious, yeah. Uh, oh, yeah. What's uh, next? Z? Uh, Dominic. Tuna without the crust. <laughs> uh, it seems like we hit the end, Nick. It seems as if we've hit the end. It seems as if we've hit the end. And with that, we leave you with a please subscribe. Oh, to the- no, we don't. Oh, pal. Oh. I got something for all of you guys. Whoa. Oh. A listener sent us a package, and he hated how you guys weren't getting any good fucking Pokemon card pulls. So he made personalized packs for the boys with specific names on each of the packs. Personalized. Oh, so anyone that doesn't pack? appreciate the Pokemon cards, I'm giving you time now. You can fucking leave. What's his name? <laughs> smart, Bill. That this is, is a, a smart great move question. I did once. not look into that. Well, well I mean, I if this guy that. created yeah. packs, we better be getting some So this guy doctored yeah. up the packs. He juiced them so up. So I already know oh. I'm getting a bad pack. Oh, yeah. no. no, no, no. I think oh, my got first got card well, is a Snorlax. Let's go. Fucking Fucking needle. Already got out of the car. And <laughs> it's oh, dude! Up. What was that? B. <laughs> Charmander. Char- a rare Charmander. Cross oh, 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 oh my god! How do we get? open Fucking these Gyarados is my first. What? One. I got Obstagoon. We already had those. <laughs> oh. What? He gave y'all fat Pokemon. Oh, oh. <laughs> I got a t- <laughs> fucking licky licky. Oh, settlement. Oh, toxic uh, toxicity. Oh, 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 keeping that fucking one. Steelix. Oh, I got the Mega Transformation. <laughs> 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 Hollow, fucking Pikachu, and Raichu. This, these things are staying. And I got the m- rarest card in the game. This is oh, yeah? bullshit. Does that, does that fucking Mewtwo, does dude. Does that 328 HP, bro? I got Mewtwo, dude. This one's got 330 hit power. Dude, Rhyperior. I, I got mean. fucking Kartal. Oh, Grimstar. I got what the dinos. fuck? I yeah. can't One's stronger believe. than the other. I got a Toxtricity. I, I got mean, a. I got Luxray, Yellow Monkey. I sideways. can't believe a listener spent twenty grand on each of us. I got a Ho O. What? <laughs> the oh! And obviously the Zard. <laughs> you got the Zards. I only got the Mander. Got the Zard, dude. This is awesome. I'm keeping this yeah. fucking thing right here. Hey, Sorry, thanks, no, dude. Thank you, dude. Thank you. Hey, thank you. Or named listener. Thank you. Do that. Named listener. Or do that, Drew. Thank you. Have a day. I'm putting on my story right now. Toxtricity. Let's go. What the fuck? Awesome. Sorry, you got a Snorlax. <laughs> Z. Z, what did you get? Fucking Snorlax. That's it? That's the only card you got? All fat Pokemon. <laughs> if they all had a way in together, be one ton. Who? Josh Shook. Oh, Josh, Josh Shook. Shook. Josh Shook. Thank, Thank, you. Josh. Thank, Josh. You. Thank Josh. you, dude. I don't know if we can zoom in here at all, man, but they sent this sweet. guy a lick it tongue. Oh, you got uh, a lick it tongue. Licky, lick it tongue. Lickety split. Fuck that is a fat. Yeah. That's, That's my wife. That's for me for my pack. If you want to give me one from your yeah, pack, you know what I will. <laughs> free. I will. I'll trade you Guzzlord. <laughs> no way. <laughs> Guzzlord. Jesus. <laughs> Uh, all right shout out you guys for riding with us till the end here if you want to follow along with all the antics and watch along go check us out on youtube at youtube.com slash the pod pmi or just give it a goog a fucking whale <laughs> See, you got just a has a name whale rap here <laughs> Man, this thing's awesome. Thank you, guys. Fucking greedy like, guys. Thank you, yeah. guys. Thank you. See you on Friday. Oh, Sweet. this one dumps them out. <laughs> Al Creamy? Al Creamy? <laughs> Al Creamy? Oh, wow. Double my.